This is the final part of my solar USB charger. I pretty much completed it. This is the 6 volt panel. It won't charge as nicely as my 5 watt or my 1.8 watt panel. It will probably be good to just uh, for light use. Okay, um, this is how it looks. This is you. Our battery pack with four batteries here. I have another battery pack for four more batteries and there's an on off switch here so I can charge all eight batteries or four at a time. And this is the connection. I can cut off the alligator clips and put the input in there directly. And inside I have a USB board. This is a regulated uh, output board. Uh, originally the board is supposed to be able to boost the voltage but it doesn't seem to do that. And I put in an on off switch. So this is how it looks. I can close it. And then I can plug in any USB devices. So this turns it on. I added the reflectors because they actually increases the voltage when you're charging it in the sun. Plus when it is used with a USB light it would be sort of like a like a lampshade or a light shade. So if you're sitting next to it you won't have the glaring uh, light of the LED. I was even thinking of making it regenerative but the light doesn't work that well with a 6 volt panel at night. It only gives like maybe a couple of volts so that's not enough to put power back into the the battery pack. With the 1.8 volt uh, solar panel I was testing with, this light can slow down the discharge of the batteries because some of the light is gone back into the battery pack. But since I'm using this small solar panel, uh, the regenerative part of uh, my theory is not panning out. So that is that. So you could use this as a power pack to charge any USB devices. Something like an iPod. It will bring it back up to 100%. Your phone, you see it at 100% when you charge and you put it in. So that switches it off. So I have eight anti-loop batteries here. These are second generation anti-loop batteries and they can be charged 1500 times supposedly. The regular USB solar power packs, they usually come with lithium ion batteries and with a very small solar panel I kind of doubt they can give you a good charge with a solar panel. It, the fact that it is it uses renewable energy rather than uh, the AC plug-in type recharger. So it could be done better. This could be, but it is a prototype and it is a funny looking device. This solar panel actually you can add another similar panel to it and you can just like you when you're making a solar panel you can just put it in series. That would make it 12 volt and it would be a stronger uh, solar charger. 
the panel is actually about $10. We'll see how it goes for now. Okay, that this completes my project for this indoor solar rechargeable power pack. Thanks for watching.